Hello beautiful souls and welcome back to Pause for Self-Care with Di. I thought I would share something a little special with you today and I do hope you enjoy it and I do hope that you realize what a special person you are. The inability to receive support from others is a trauma response. Your, I don't need anyone, I'll just do it all myself, is a survival tactic. And you needed it to shield your heart from abuse, neglect, betrayal, and disappointment from those who could not or would not be there for you. From the parent who was absent and abandoned you by choice or the parent who was never home working three jobs to feed and house you from the lovers who offered intimacy but never offered a safe haven that honored your heart from the friendships and family who always took more than they ever gave from all the situations when someone told you, we're in this together, or I got you, then abandoned you, leaving you to pick up the pieces when shit got real, leaving you to handle your part and their part too. From all the lies and all the betrayals, You learned along the way that you couldn't really trust people or that you could trust people, but only up to a certain point. Extreme independence is a trust issue. You learned, if I don't put myself in a situation where I rely on someone, I won't have to be disappointed when they don't show up for me. Or when they drop the ball. Because they will always drop their ball eventually, right? You may even have been intentionally taught this protection strategy by generations of hurt. From ancestors who came before you. Extreme independence is a preemptive strike against heartbreak. So you don't trust anyone and you don't trust yourself either to choose people. To trust is to hope. To trust is to be vulnerable. Never again you vow, never ever again. But no matter how you dress it up and display it proudly to make it seem like the level of independence is what you always wanted to be. In truth, it's your wounded, scared, broken hearts behind a protective brick wall. Impenetrable. Nothing gets in, no hurt gets in, but no love gets in either. Fortresses and armor are for those in battle or who believe the battle is coming. It's a trauma response. The good news is trauma that is acknowledged, is trauma that can be healed. You are worthy of having support. You are worthy of having true partnership. You are worthy of love. You are worthy of having your heart held. You are worthy to be adored. You are worthy to be cherished. You are worthy to have someone say, you rest, I've got this, and actually deliver on that promise. You are worthy to receive. You are worthy to receive you are worthy you don't have to earn it you don't have to prove it you don't have to bargain for it 
You don't have to beg for it. You are worthy. Worthy simply because you exist. You are worthy. Thank you so much everyone for joining me today and I hope that you realized how worthy you are today. Please do hit subscribe if you are new and thank you to those who are loyal followers. Do follow me on socials. I tend to share lots more little extra tips during the week. Cheerio and remember to pause for self-care.